My first impression with religion was primarily that of being bored by it and thinking that it looked stupid. I was interested in Ninja Turtles. That was a lot more interesting to me. Um, and I didn't ever, the first time I ever had a conflict with religion was when I was staying the night at one of my friend's houses and I thought what you do when you stay at the night at someone's house is tell ghost stories. And they uh, forbid me from doing so because it was, you know, satanic or something like that. But it was against their religious views. And I actually couldn't wrap my head around it at the time. I'm just like, I don't understand. It's, it's just a ghost story. Um, and I encountered several things like that throughout my childhood that, you know, it's really more frustrating because I, I wasn't the one having to deal with that oppression. But it's like, Hey, let's go hang out. Sorry, you're not a Christian. It's like what? It was always really weird for me. I, I never really believed in the the Jesus stuff, but like for a brief period in high school, I kind of wanted to, just because when you're in high school, you want to fit in and you want to make friends. And I actually even went to a, a church a couple times to try to like understand where they were coming from, and it, it just felt so fake. It, it's like. I, even if I wanted to believe this to fit in, I, I can't. It just doesn't make any sense to me. Um, and also throughout my school, I always saw like that there was open religion. And my mom always was a big proponent of making sure I understood there was separation of church and state. Even though like she wouldn't consider herself an atheist as much as I would, like the idea of keeping the government out of that and keeping the church out of the government, that's a big deal for her. So, like, whenever I would, like, hear my home ec teacher talk about how we're a Christian nation, I flat up told her, no, we're not, actually, and I debated with her in front of everyone, but no one was sympathetic. The entire class was on her side. They're like, you know, we're a Christian nation. So, it, it's very frustrating more than anything else. My mom made a big focus on me being open-minded towards religion and, and, like, making my own decision, which is a good way to make an atheist. If you're going to look at all religions with an even hand, they all kind of look like bullshit. And so, that was in me early on. But like actual critical thinking skills weren't. I believed in a lot of really crazy stuff like ancient aliens, um, ESP, stuff like that, you know, and that, that stuff was fun and I watched sightings and stuff like that. And it wasn't until, you know, I grew up and moved away that I realized, wait a second, something's not making sense with that. And so it wasn't until I actually found the skeptic movement, uh, outside of just being an atheist, because I'd already read Dawkins and stuff like that, that I realized, wait a second, I need to be applying this to other things in my life. Uh, there are lots of things that don't make sense. Um, so yeah, reading The God Delusion helped me realize that there's more to, than just being an atheist. You have to be a critical thinker. I urge people to actually look into all of the claims that are being made. Even if you're you know, a kid in high school, and you can't be out about that. If you are being told that you know that you're going to go to hell and that you're going to lose the support of your family if you believe a certain way, by all means, keep it a secret for right now. You know, keep learning, keep reading, uh, keep meeting other people who have different views than you, uh, keep expanding those horizons because there will be a day when you can actually take control of your own life and uh, examine everything as freely as you want to. Uh, it might not be this day, but it will come. I'm Stephen Olson. I've been an atheist my entire life. There is a community waiting right here for you. As soon as you're ready to come out, we'll be waiting for you, and we are atheism.